to do. We um, get some oil, about, yeah, that much will do. Not too much oil, that much will do. Use any onions you like. You can use um, red onions or you can use um, um, yellow onions. Whichever onions you prefer. I prefer sweet onions, you know, the red onions. More sweeter, more flavour, more taste. So what I'll do then is um, separate the lot into round bits. Here, it's ready. So you put all the onions in there, fry it up, bay leaves, put bay leaves in there, about one, two, three, about five bay leaves. So you fry the bay leaves with the onions, mm, the aroma is beautiful. Yeah? Bay leaves. Oh, and you've got thyme in there as well if you want to. Add some thyme in there. The time. And me personally, I like to add <coughs> garlic. Yeah? There is no food that I cook without garlic. If I'm lazy, if I can't be able to cut any garlic, I use this one, you know? This. It's not bad. Garlic paste. Hmm. This flavour, the aroma is nice, bro. Aroma, beautiful thyme, sage, onion. Put a bit of garlic in there. Put a bit of garlic in there. There we go. Dollop of garlic. One dollop of garlic. Shit, sit there for like a half hour. That shit sit there. Right one. That shit sit there. Let it saute. So once it's sauteed, it's like let me pause this for a minute and I come back. Oh, the flavour is magnificent. The flavour is beautiful, bro. So we've got in here red onions, we've got some bay leaves, we've got some thyme, we've got some um, um, garlic in there. What we do now, get a cube. You can use any cube, you can use a Maggi cube, if you want to, you can use chicken stock cube. Personally, I prefer Maggi. So what I'm going to do first, is get the... They call this tomato paste. So you put a large quantity amount, about you know two two teaspoons, a large amount of tomato paste. And then you turn it, you turn it, you turn it, you turn it. You put the cube. And they say Ghanaian jollof rice is better than Nigerian. They must be mad, bro. The flavour that I smell right now, it's like Nigeria. Mm. It's hitting you right here, bro. What are you talking about? What are you talking about Ghanaian jollof is better than Nigerian? Are you mad, bro? Bro, you're mad. If you ain't tasted my jollof rice, 
Yeah, if you ain't tasted my jello fries, then you don't know what jello fries is. I like to add a bit of um, jello fry seasoning. You know, it gives it that smoky element, that real flavour. Okay, now, oh, it's about six, eight minutes. All that together, six to eight minutes. Give it another few minutes or so. Right, it's all sauteed. Back. Now, the peppers that I cooked earlier, these peppers contain um, red peppers, tomato, onions, and um, the alpino peppers, those red peppers. So you boil it up. And then you put that in there. Yep. You add some salt, a bit of salt. A bit of um, jello seasoning. Not too much, about half a teaspoon. Okay. Then you add the other cube. You add your cube. Soon, we'll be adding the rice that I boiled earlier on. The rice I boiled, part of boiled. In fact, I didn't boil the rice. You can boil the rice if you want to, but I, I just washed the rice. Okay, where's the rice? I'm going to put the rice in here. I mean, this rice is not enough. Now. This rice is not enough for. Let me, let me wash some more rice. Turn this down. Put the rice in here. The rice is not enough. I need more rice. Let's put it on pause. I've well, got enough rice now. In here. Have I got too much stew in here? I don't know, bruv. Probably got too much stew. Too much tomato sauce. Okay. Nah, it's alright. Now just add a bit more water. Go. Now we let this shit sit for like a half hour. Let that shit sit for like about half hour. 
And then we've got the butt we've got the butter ready. And we've got the, this thing ready. Right. I might I make I had I had this rice already cooked before before I was other when I was hungry, but I might add this later on. If I've got enough room in the pot, I'm gonna add this rice to it. Because this room's already, this rice is already cooked. I don't wanna add the cooked rice to the ones that ain't been cooked. It won't, it won't, it won't balance. So once this rice is cooked, um, I'll add this rice, mix it up, add some butter, and then cover it with that tin foil, and we're away, okay? The chicken's already in the air fryer being cooked. Now cover this up. And go and chill, watch some Colombo, daytime TV. Easy, simple, later. Okay, back here. 15 minutes later, now let's stir this rice. Jollof rice is looking a bit too rich. So what I'm going to do is add more rice into it. Add this rice, soak up all that juice, right? Oh my darling, oh my darling, oh my darling, Clementine. <laughs> okay. Right, let's put some butter in here, right? some butter in here. Some butter on the top. Yeah. Now what you do, you get tin foil, you cover that up, so it steams up. There's a cover. The lid, and you put the lid on it. And turn the heater down. Okay. And give it another uh, 10 minutes or so. Okay, now. Keep the come out. Okay, so on lower heat now. Chicken's in a air fryer, it's about another five minutes for the chicken. I'm gonna come back in a minute. Okay, we're back here. I've taken out the Mmm, lovely, lovely. Let's stir this rice. Jollof rice, jollof rice, jollof rice. Beautiful. Tasty. What we do now is we add the chicken in there, yeah? The chicken encompasses the flavour. Add that in there. Mmm. Mmm, yummy. 
I'm hungry, bruv. I'm fucking hungry. And you cover it up. No. Give that another 15 minutes. We'll come back later. Prep. What you do then, you get a pot. The tomatoes is cooked. Get a pot, put a pot on the stove. Now you want to get some vegetable oil. Vegetable oil. Alright. You need, um, need some bay leaves. Oh, shit. <laughs> This is live, man. This is live. Hey, you got some babies, right? So what you want to do is just use a frying pan, which I use. Yeah, I'm going to use this one. Let's see the progress. Uh. Oh, this pot's full up, bro. <laughs> That's what you call jollof rice. How it would taste that? You do you put some in there? Put this. So, do you think I should open a store for people that are hungry out there? No, we'll start a business. You know, get 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 go to offices in London, get a huge contract, and start making them rice. Okay, turn it off. Turn off rice ready. Bam, 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 bam. Please like, share, comment, and subscribe. If you like my food. If you want any catering done, if you want any food cooked for you, anything, any Nigerian food, let me know. Um, give me an order uh, and a budget, and I'll get it done for you. Simple. No, no, no deals too big. No orders too large. I'll get it done because I'm a chef. Please like, share, comment, and subscribe. Thank you very much, people.